welcome to a weekly vlog i am back on track with my vlogs or trying to be because today's wednesday i just posted my daily vlog on my channel so yeah if you haven't watched that you can go ahead and watch it but today is wednesday august 4th you guys how can i forget the date because our girl started sixth grade today and it was a little bit emotional but when it comes to my kids i'm always emotional so <laughs> it wasn't nothing for me to like shed a tear while i was alone turn the air down but yeah they started sixth grade today they're in person they haven't been in person in some you know in a while like over almost two years they haven't been in person so it's arrived their first day and yeah they liked it so i just got i just facetimed them not too long ago and asked them about school i am currently out it's wednesday so i'm running errands and i'm actually parked at ulta hold on my lips are dry i'm actually parked at ulta because i need to uh get like a wax kit I usually use the GG hard wax and I ran out so I need to go get some more I don't feel like waiting to get it off of Amazon you know Amazon like it's okay but I need it like today not you know in a couple days so I am going to hopefully see if they have it in stock there's a super target across the street I might go there but I don't know if I want to go to Target today. <laughs> that sounds crazy, right? I don't know if I want to go to Target because I'm proud of myself that I have everything in my house. Y'all, my nails are still ghetto. I'm proud of myself that I have mainly all the necessities that I need for my house, like paper towels, cleaning supplies, air fresheners, like carpet cleaner, like all that stuff I'm pretty much stocked up on. I don't really need anything. So let's go to Ulta real quickly. Hold on, let me put my mask on because y'all, Corona trying to get locked up again and I ain't trying to have that. So I'm always going to, well, I got my hand sanitizer. I done brought me my disinfecting wipes, wiping stuff down. Because I don't know what y'all got in spray bottles, but I don't want none of that. I want my wipes and I'll be all right. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's go. All right. Hi, hi. Okay. I'm only taking cash at the moment. That's my key. Get the heck on out of here. Ooh, tropical mango. I love this stuff. They got tropical mango. I just got one, so I don't need one, but nice. Um, okay. Wax, 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 wax. Where is the wax? Got it. This is what I was looking for. They better give me my change too. All right, you guys, I'm in Home Depot. It's so funny, because when we first moved into our house, I felt like I was here every day. I really did. Like, light bulbs, just different stuff for the fireplace, like, just crazy. But, um, we're looking for a refrigerator. Um, excuse me, do you know what our refrigerator um, filters are? Yeah, I'll right there. Okay, so I got I need to get a refrigerator filter. <laughs> like I said, a refrigerator filter. <sighs> Here we are down the aisle. I think it's please. No? Let me see. And it was in the wrong aisle. She said 25. No, she said 26 actually. It's 20 31. Girl, I was right here. Oh, right here. Okay, so I think this is the one I need every day. I yeah, I think this is the one I need every day, right? Yeah. Well, pull. Yeah, this is the one I need. Hopefully, it fits. I'll keep my receipt just in case. But I already researched it, and I'm pretty sure this is the one. Thank you. All right, headed to the house. We got the filter. Hey guys, it is August 5th. It's around 5.24. And y'all already know the deal. I'm in my office. Y'all see the background, y'all know the bonnet, the robe. Y'all know what's about to go down. So I'm getting ready, you guys, to go out. Um, I think I mentioned this yesterday, but we are going to the Kanye West listening party. This is like the second one he's had. Uh, we didn't go to the first one, so 
just gonna go to the second one i'm surprised that i even want to go out considering like you know we just got back from the bahamas what sunday and it's only wednesday gosh it feels like an entire week has already went by but it hasn't so i'm just shocked thank you guys so much for your concerns with macy she's fine um i'm not really like too you know scared about this whenever she gets sick you know what i mean we we raised two kids already <laughs> So, she's not that we've never seen before. She's fine, but she's back to school. And yeah, I'm just doing my brows, getting ready. My air is gonna keep going on and off. It's on auto, so I do apologize about that. I didn't show you guys yesterday when I came back in the house from Home Depot. I didn't show you guys like the clothes that I got. I don't even know if it fits or if it looks right. I went shopping yesterday for an outfit and I don't even know what it looks like. Well, I know what it looks like, but on, because I haven't tried it on. Honestly, I've been so, I've been kind of like home lazy, meaning like I didn't leave my house, but I was doing a lot of stuff today. Like I did a laundry, I've been doing laundry all day. And then I unpacked my stuff. And then I also, hold on, my mom's calling me. Then I changed the refrigerator filter because you guys know or saw me look for one in Home Depot and thank goodness it was the correct one. Because like I said, I did my research before I actually purchased it. So I changed the, the fridge filter I add, and then I also cleaned out the, what is that, carpet cleaner? Because the kids used the carpet cleaner and we did like empty the water out. But I had to clean like the brush part. That was so nasty so I had to clean that out bleached it down and everything so I just been like around the house doing I don't know woman stuff cleaning the house and stuff laundry and chores but I didn't go anywhere today I knew I wasn't gonna go anywhere today I knew I was gonna just you know relax until it was time to get ready last night I ended up doing my hair and my wig but I washed it and then I conditioned it. I washed and conditioned my hair. My hair is actually braided down so that I can put the wig on. And I also wax. You guys saw me go to Ulta and buy this wax kit. It's the microwave wax kit. I like this wax kit. I don't use it. Is it the Brazilian bikini one? Yeah, it's the Brazilian, Brazilian bikini one, but I don't use it for that area. I use it for like my brows and lip like upper lip and my chin and stuff that's what i use it for i was using my elf concealer heavily like in the bahamas like pretty much that's all i was using so i actually like ran out and i did some more because i didn't realize it was all gone i have this in the holes and that's money sleep and that's probably because I got my lashes done. That always happens to me once I get my lashes done. Y'all already know that when I get my lashes done, I start to just have allergies. Like, it's just, it's just how it is. I have a question for you guys. Let me know in the comment section. Are you guys, like, decorating for Halloween? I don't mean fall. That's completely different. If you know, you know. It's completely different. Are you guys going to go ahead and decorate for Halloween? Because I was just thinking... If I did or didn't, it's a hair. I don't know if I am or if I'm not because I was thinking about it. Um, what was I thinking about? I was thinking about it like a couple days ago. I was like, dang, you know, this is our first year in this house, and it's like the year where we get to do everything because when we moved in, you guys know that we didn't get to do anything because the holidays were over with basically we moved in right after like all the holidays were done we kind of moved in like after new year's so now we are like getting into that point where we're going to be in this house enjoying all the holidays so i was thinking like i don't know if i should decorate for halloween or should i take the kids trick-or-treating because they told me that this year most likely will be the last year that they go trick-or-treating. So I'm like, dang, do I wanna pass out candy or do I wanna go trick-or-treating? 
I don't know. I need to decide because if I'm not going out, then I wanna decorate. But if I am going out, then I don't wanna like go full on, you know, decorating. And if you guys do decorate for your house, do you do like full on animatronics or do you just do like, you know, just a little bit of Halloween decor out front. I'm talking about like out front in your house in front of your house not like inside and i'm using my florence mist i like this mist sorry if it's bright like my ring light is right in front of me but the sun is setting and i wanted to make sure you know my makeup was good because i can't really see from the lighting in this room i don't know why i like to put laura mercier um setting powder underneath like right here i don't know why it just looks good right there Ooh. going in with my cocoa nutty of course i don't know why i did not like this bronzer at first but now i've grown to really really like it see i really like this before i was gonna return it but then it grew on me you guys, I'm watching um, Chelsea, and someone was like, oh, shout her out. And a couple of you guys have been telling me, like, she's told, she mentioned you in her video, so that's how I found you. And it's so funny because um, I always comment on her vlogs. Like, I've been commenting on her vlogs because I've been watching them lately, and we have became friends on Instagram and stuff. She seems so sweet and nice. And I love her decor. It's really cute. I'm pretty sure you guys know who that is. But I'll link her channel below. I'll put her name on your screen so y'all know who I'm talking about. So I'm pretty much done. I'm about to go put on my wig and try this outfit on. Hopefully everything looks right because I don't really have a plan B. I mean, I kind of do, but I don't have time to do all that. And oh yeah, my finger, I don't have a nail on this finger because um it cracked and it's just too painful to put a nail on it but i got my other nails on they're like this pink color so you see very nudie very cute very classy but yeah guys i'll be right back. guys all right so i am done with hair and makeup obviously y'all can tell have on the same wig that i've been wearing the one that was with me in bahamas and all that the one i just currently been wearing is the u-part wig from amazon from Ally Mice Hair, I think. I will link it below. The wig, the unit, it is a U-part wig. I just ended up putting it to a middle part. It has like four clips, which is why I absolutely love this wig. Not sponsored or anything, but I love the wig because it has wig clips instead of like the combs. So I'm about to try on the outfits for you guys. <laughs> Rambling. I'm about to try on the outfits for you guys and for myself, because I don't know what they look like, so. I'm going to see what my options are. Okay, guys, this is the first outfit. I don't know if y'all could tell, but it's like this blue spandexy kind of scuba tank top. It's actually a bodysuit that snaps at the crotch area. And then I have these jawstring Zara pants. They kind of have like this scrunch at the ankle. Um, I don't know. Like, it's these pants. I don't like the pants, you guys. Like, they're cute. I don't like them. Okay, guys, this is outfit two. Y'all already can tell, or hopefully y'all can tell. I'm satisfied. So, this is the tank top that I got from H&M. I don't have a bra on because I don't have a bra that goes this way. Like, I kind of have a bra that can, like, razor back or racer back <laughs> in the back, but... This one is just, it's just too, it looks like it's backwards, but it's not. It's frontwards, so no bra tonight, but I have these Zara pants. These are the favorite kind of pants I like from Zara. They're the, what kind of pants are these? Mom, what kind of pants are these? Oh, they're the baggy fit, if y'all can see that. They're the baggy fit ones. They're a size 34 in Europe. So it's a size 2 in the US. And they fit your waist really tight. Like they're baggy, but they're they're tight, but they're comfortable because they're like kind of baggy. So you see, I still have room to like move around, but it kind of still fits like my butt tight and like 
my waist small so because i'm actually bloated so but i also have on the green shades that i said i didn't like y'all remember these shades from shein that i tried on a couple vlogs back and i said i didn't like them but i'm gonna wear them tonight because i don't know if i could tell but i was kind of going for like a kim k look like i love her style so i wanted to do like my wig straight with like you know one side tucked behind my ear with the neutral colors and then i don't know if y'all can see but i have these boots on they're like they're like these gray ankle boots but the heel is so small so they're easy to walk in and they're like they have a pointy toe and they come up on the ankle these are a size 38 and i got them from h&m for like what 35 dollars or something like that but yeah i just have this outfit together so yeah i'm happy i knew the other outfit i'm about to return that because the outfit was way more expensive than this one and i love this one better like i didn't like nothing from zara except for these pants all right guys so here's a full look i don't know if y'all can see because it's kind of dark but i have on my ankle boots from h&m that i got and yeah this is a full outfit so i'm about to get into the car and head out so we're leaving now because we don't we want to beat traffic and the parking so i will see y'all there <laughs> Show starts well it's supposed to start at nine. But you know, they never start on time. or good afternoon shall i say it is saturday august 7th so yes i skipped the day of filming i apologize um i wasn't feeling up to it i think it's because my cycle's coming on so i'm a little emotional <laughs> joking but not for i am emotional <clears throat> but it's only because like everything's happening so fast and i'm just like you know my cycle's coming like i said so yesterday i didn't feel like filming i actually didn't do anything all day i showered i ate and i relaxed in my bed all day and it felt so good like i hardly do that so i ended up doing that yesterday but i'm happy i did because sometimes like as far as like my brain goes i'm like i gotta do it i gotta film i gotta film i gotta film i gotta do it but when i take a day off to just to myself it just feels so good I know that kind of feels like guilty sometimes to just like take days off to ourselves and not do anything, especially when we have kids as a mother. But we need it, guys. You need it, I need it, we all need it. So do not feel guilty. And it's so important because it's like, if you don't do it, you're not gonna get better. You're not gonna get better. So you might as well, you know, slow down, not do nothing for that day and start again tomorrow. So as y'all can see, my energy's on 10 because I took the time off, okay? So I'm sorry, like I said, I didn't film, but today we plan on going to the mall um, and we plan on going to Pont City Market, which is like this shop that I take you guys to all the time. If you're in Atlanta, you live in Atlanta, you guys know what I'm talking about. There's only one Pont City Market out here. I am getting my um, candles and crystals because a new moon is coming, A8. Okay, period, so we're about to do that. My sister's coming, also Felicia, you guys know my friend who moved here. Also guys, I'm glad I thought about it and I'm glad, I'm glad I remembered, but Felicia is my friend, you guys seen her on my YouTube channel. She recently moved here and I featured her apartment, like I showed you guys like a little bit of her apartment and her bed. I have the headboard linked below, I have the headboard linked. I got so many questions on it. It is a custom piece, meaning like her bed didn't, her headboard didn't come like that. She purchased the panels because it's a panel headboard. So I have it linked below. There's tons and tons of reviews on it. 
it's a lot of good reviews it's a lot of pictures if you guys want to see there's different colors she has like the cute rust orange burnt orange color but they have tons of other colors on there and you could do it any way you want to you can do it all the way up to the ceiling the panels or you could do it how she has it wide weights or whatever you can mix and match the colors however you want to do it it's completely customizable and um, yeah, I have it linked below in my description box. So make sure you guys check that out because I got a lot of questions about her bed and I'm just like, I don't know, it's not my bed. Let me show you guys, cause I posted this on my YouTube like communities channel. Uh, communities, whatever, I don't know what to call it, community tab. But you guys, look at my little collection. I'm proud of myself because it is building. Uh, okay. Let me show y'all my little collection here. Y'all already see it, but I have to put it this way because I am ready. Okay, so I have my pumpkin spice. Everything is nice. Um, candle burning from Walmart. And then I got Mrs. Myers. You guys, I love Mrs. Myers. I've had Mrs. Myers for a minute now. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you know I post about Mrs. Myers all the time. They have limited edition scents coming out right now and have the apple cider scent. Oh, it smells so good. I love that I can find like products like these that are like not harsh, but still have like fall scents and smell nice. I love this so much. And you guys know I got the <laughs> pumpkin spices things up blade spray too. So I'm starting my collection. That's why I pulled this out. I'm starting my collection. I just want to show you guys like I'm sorry, my collection, y'all. I couldn't find, I couldn't find the spray, but I just got the honeysuckle lemon one. But I cannot wait to get like the full collection. They have this brown one too. I think it's like acorn something. That one smells really nice too. But I really need some dish soap, soap, and I'm glad that I was able to find the apple cider one from Mrs. Meyer. So y'all, my fall collection ooh, is you know <laughs> building up which is also why i am going to bath and body works because i have strayed long enough away from bath and body works and i'm gonna go today to get some candles um i'm not f tripping because it's not gonna be my only you know this is not gonna be my only visit to bath and body works i know i'm going to be going to bath and body works so many times this year but I just want to go today because I keep getting emails about their sales and their fall scents. I keep seeing the little brown leaves in my inbox, y'all. So I got to go. I got to go to Bath & Body Works. This vlog is all about like Bath & Body Works shopping, like going out and stuff. Next vlog will be about getting those curtains up. And it's time to order the console table for right over there like right there it's time to order the console table that area has been bare enough i actually want the console table more i mean not the console table is it the console table i'm talking about i guess so yeah the console table i want to order that before i get the actual buffet table in the dining room so I need to stop contemplating on it and just do it because furniture is not coming in like it used to. It's gonna be, you know, more money. I mean, it's gonna take more time, you know? So I just need to like stop doing that and just order it. So that's what we're gonna do next week. <laughs> I don't wanna spend money. That's what we're gonna do next week is order that arch, you know, that arch um, table that I've been eyeing for the longest time. Babe and I have been eyeing it. He even likes it. So I'm just like, okay, we need to order that like ASAP. So that's what we're gonna do. I am about to get dressed right now actually because uh, we're about to head out to the mall, like I said. The kids wanna go to the mall. I wanna get there early. I don't like being around the mall and crowded. I hate going to the mall on Saturdays. But the kids wanna go to the mall. You know, now that they're in school, they just wanna go out on the weekends because like during the week we don't go anywhere because of school and stuff. So they wanna go out to the mall. And then, yeah, we're gonna go to the store. It's just gonna have like, you know, a chill out Saturday, like an outing day, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, I'm about to get dressed real quick. So I will come back on here after I'm done. We're at Pond City Market with my sister. <laughs> Trying to pay for parking. It's a hassle. Pond City Market, y'all. 
to go inside of the kitchen. I don't have gold. It's really cute though. I don't have any gold. Look at these pillows are cute. I need a throw for my living room. I was going to get the Hermes inspired one, but I feel like I need a different throw. Hey, does this look nice, Chima? Look at this mirror. Oh my gosh. So cute. This mirror is so nice. This is so nice. I love these pillows. This is more of my area with the gray, black, and white. Guys. Ready to tear it up. This one smells okay. Let me smell it. They're looking. And that is giving me. It's giving me uh, summertime still. Okay, so here are all the candles. All three weeks, $15.99. So I got my bag. Oh, okay. I want me a. I want. Hmm? Oh, that one smells really good. What's that? The pecan, uh, the pumpkin pecan waffles. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna. I want that one. This one smells good too, guys. Pecan vanilla cream. Hey, smell this one. This is not strong enough for me. Mahogany apples. Where's the top? Oh, right there. Um, what was this one? Pumpkin what? I have a pumpkin one already. It's not bad. Yeah. It's so good. Uh, pumpkin apples. You guys come here and smell this. Mm. Oh, smells good, right? Mm. Oh my god, no, heck no, smell this one, guys. So. Oh, it's not that bad? No, it smells like somebody's grandmother is the <laughs> <kitty litter. laughs> <laughs> <I do. laughs> They have all of the Halloween stuff now. Um, look at all, you guys, look at this. Wicked Apple Halloween oh Edition my one. My oh my god. <coughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> oh my god, smell this. Smell this. Oh my god. Ew. She wants to smoke this. Wait, she wants to smoke this. Smell this one. Ew, why is this smell? I like it. I like vampire blood. I don't like this one. Wicked oh Apple smells oh wicked. What was that called? Vampire blood. Wicked Apple oh smells it's wicked. Not it not smells it. disgusting. <laughs> It does. What's that one smell like? Oh, yeah. I don't think I'm a fan of the Halloween. I don't think I'm a fan of the Halloween one that came out. I'm not finding anything that smells good. I know vampire blood. Pumpkin carving doesn't smell good either. Pumpkin spice latte. This just looks aesthetically pleasing over here, this area. These do smell awful. Oh my god. Awful? Champagne What's toast coffee? Smells the best. Oh. Oh, that was so good. Smell no, champagne toast it smells yeah. really good. Oh, that smells so good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that in here and put one of the champagne toasts in here. Alright, I hope this stays in my nose for the rest of my life. Hey guys, so I'm finally home. It is about 10.53, which is kind of late because... Uh, my camera actually ran out of memory card so while I was in the store I didn't get to film while we were in 
Bath and Body Works, but we ended up um, leaving Bath and Body Works and coming home. So I didn't really stay in the mall anyway. But I wanted to show you guys a quick haul because you guys know I love doing, you know, a little haul showing you guys what I got. Y'all see the Bath and Body Works bag. So let's prop you guys up. And I didn't get that much, surprisingly. I don't know if you guys can tell, but there weren't that many like good smelling scents, which is weird because Bath and Body Works scents usually are like so good. But mm, I don't know, maybe my nose was off or something, but it wasn't all that good to me. Like some of the things that I thought was gonna smell really good didn't really smell good at all. So I don't know. All right, y'all. So here is the big bag that we have for Bath and Body Works. And I'm going to show you guys the first one that I got. This is an OG. You guys already know I got champagne toast. I love champagne toast. It's bubbly champagne, bright berries, juicy tangerine. If you guys never had champagne toast before, get you champagne toast and try it because it smells amazing. I love this candle. I do like the rose pink um, color of the candle. It looks nice. The smell is just amazing. Like I said, this is a very like OG type of candle. So yeah, I had to get that one. The next one I got is pumpkin apple, which looks like this. It's just the pumpkin apple. These are the white barn candles. Um, for me, white barn smells better than the actual Bath and Body Works uh, candles. That's just my opinion. Like I do like the some of the Bath and Body Works candles that are like truly themed with fall or winter like their blueberry pancake waffle or some of those but most of the time i get the white barn ones especially because the aesthetic of them are simple and cute versus like the bath and body works where they have like actual like drawings and like art on it i don't like that i just like simple clean candles but this one is pumpkin apple it's red apple pumpkin ground cinnamon and Ooh, I love this candle. I love me a good spicy apple candle. I like apple candles, but I like for them to have like a strong cinnamon smell as well. And this smells like pumpkin, apple, and cinnamon, which mm, it smells amazing. I can't wait to burn this one. These candles were $15.95, I believe, as well. Like they're three wick candles were like on sale which kind of sucks because i wish i got more of them but i didn't because i don't know like i said some of their stuff was smelling stinky i got another og which is sweater weather it's fresh shade the fresh sage juniper berries and eucalyptus you guys know like juniper um juniper sage and like cedar and all that is like my type of smell this might not be everyone else's smell but it's mine mm, the eucalyptus really does smell strong in this candle so it kind of smells like the kids would say their dad but <laughs> to me it just smells like eucalyptus but yeah i got sweater weather you guys know this is the og candle like champagne toast so Mm, yeah, it smells so good. Can't wait to burn this one. And then the last one that I got is pumpkin vanilla cream. I actually should have gotten, I should have gotten like two. I wasn't thinking. I was just stuck on like getting new scents, but I should have gotten two of each or maybe like two champagne toasts or whatever. I don't know. This one is fresh pumpkin vanilla cream and nutmeg. Mmm. This one smells so good. So yeah, these are the four candles that I got. I didn't get um, any like actual other candles. Like I said, I should have got more, but whatever. All right, guys, that is pretty much the end of the vlog. Um, I do apologize if that wasn't enough for y'all. I don't know, but tune in next week because like I said, I want to hang up our curtains or try to figure out how to hang up our curtains and also look into this console table for this area right here because fall is approaching and I wanna start looking at like decor pieces for that like little table. But you guys, we'll worry about that next week. Thank you so much for watching my channel. If you haven't already, please subscribe and click the bell below so you'll be alerted when I post a new video. And yeah guys, I'll see you in my next vlog. Bye.